it is morning. Look at that. The moon is just sitting just behind the waterline there and the sun is coming up. Oh, look at that beautiful sunset right there. That is screenshot worthy, I think. Oh, what a beautiful morning. So I've gone and grabbed us uh, some items here overnight. I was just kind of waiting until the morning to record here. So uh, we're going to go ahead and equip these and actually put them into our... Uh, our water still. Here we go. Uh, so all you have to do is fill this thing up with these uh, pond fronds, and uh, it collects water from you for you, and you can drink from it. So we should be a okay on the waterfront now. Uh, we're getting there though. That's good. Uh, we just need some food, and that is why we are going to be going after the uh, the boar over there. So what I've done is gotten ourselves together a ton of these spears because I have a feeling we're, we're going to die. We're going to find out what happens when we die here. I've never died in this game, so this would be the first. But uh, this is also only episode three, so uh, I'm pretty sure it's coming. I really don't even know how to aim these damn things. Okay, uh, well, I guess we're going to... Whoa! Well, there's a snake there. Look at this. Oh, I get it. I get it. It's kind of like the forest. Okay, here we go. And R2 the fire. It's a little low. <laughs> Let's try that again. Right above his head there. Oh, oh, damn. It's coming at me. It's coming at me with... Whoa, look at that. that that's so trippy. Where is it? Oh, damn. <laughs> look at it. It's just running around with this freaking spear coming out of its head. That is hilarious. Yeah, I really suck with these. Um, I guess... Oh! Oh, damn! It got me! I don't feel so good. Whew. Does that mean I got, like, poisoned? That sucks. At least we could pick these back up. Wow. Well, that was a learning lesson. I really, su I really suck with the spears. Oh, damn, where are you? Can't see these damn things. Where'd it go? Oh, it's right there. Is that it right there? It is. And it's gone again. Oh, these snakes suck. Oh, there it is. There it is, right there. Oh, nope. Where is it? There it is. I think it's right. Oh, no, it's starting to rain. Does that mean we have a storm coming up too? This episode, I think, is about to get very bad for me. Ah, damn it. Oh, that thing's quick. You can't even see it coming. Okay, well, I'm going to not do that anymore. And uh, move our stuff into shore here. I think we're going to be having a, a fire. So uh, let's grab our tarp and stuff up. There we go, our duct tape. Uh, we got an empty campfire. Let's, uh, let's hold this thing and bring it into shore, too. I don't know if these get uh, dragged away or not. Yeah, I hear wind. Look at this. Look at this. We are in trouble. We are in trouble. Uh-oh. What's the sound going on? This can't be good. This cannot be good at all. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. We got a thunderstorm going on here, folks. Uh, so I'm going to take this, I think, far up shore as I can here. Whoa! <laughs> I just climbed the uh, coconut tree holding the life raft. That was uh, trippy. Uh oh, check this out. We're going to witness our first thunderstorm here. Oh, no. Don't take our life raft, please. I need it. And uh, it's here. Well, let's do it. Is that my watch going off? I think it is. Do I have an alarm of sorts? Oh my god, my health. Maybe that is what that's what it's trying to tell me is my health. Status effect, bleeding and poisoning. Oh crap, I'm dead. That's what it's trying to tell me. I'm bleeding still. Can we make a band-aid? What do we need for that here? Inspect. Uh cloth, damn it. Wow. Okay, what do we need for a loom here? I think I'm dead. And it's thunderstorm. Or it's storming out. So this is going south for me. Okay, so for a loom, you need six sticks, and what is that? Four times lashing. Damn, that's expensive. 
especially on the lashing. I'm thinking here, once this passes, we're actually going to head out towards another island. Um, and we're going to find out what happens when I die. What's my health at now? Look at that. It's barely even there. I'm looking at my watch, waiting to die. Damn it. My first death, stranded deep. Shame. Don't get bitten by snakes, folks. And uh, apparently sharks give you a bleeding effect, too. I'm assuming that's where I got the bleeding from, was from the shark. Uh, so if you get bit by a shark, you're going to bleed. You need some band-aids. We don't have that yet. Uh, and you get poisoning from a snake, which isn't good. Oh, there we go. I'll see you guys in the morning. <laughs> you died from bleeding poisoning. You survived three days. <laughs> well, let's, let's go for better this time, guys. Let's go for better. Okay, so I guess what happens is you load in on your last save and that was a night cycle I spent running around and doing a few things well uh, now that I know that we actually have a status effect on us that's bleeding uh, we're gonna want to make the loom so let's go ahead here we might just actually be screwed on this game save period uh, but that's okay that's a learning lesson right um, if we have to restart we have to restart we'll do a lot better and next time anyway Okay, uh, let's go ahead and I'm going to chop down a few trees here and uh, stay away from anything that's going to poison us. I need to get I need to get this loom together. We need a bunch of sticks. So we have the sticks we need here and uh, we just now need the lashing. So let's go ahead and uh, craft up. Do we only have four? Nope, we definitely do not have enough uh, leaves to actually make this damn loom. Uh, so I think what I'm going to do is actually hop right on this thing, and we're going to take off from this island and actually make a mad dash uh, for another island before it storms, which uh, I don't know which one we came from. We came from, uh, I think, that one right there. We headed straight over here. Uh, so we're gonna head towards oh crap there's so many that one right there look how nice and close that one seems uh, let's grab what we can for the drink from the water collector and pretty much just get out of here and see what happens may as well experiment there we go we'll take what we can with us and uh, we are out of here okay well uh, it's starting to storm out, so uh, let's just let's just go for it. Let's see what happens. I can already I think I already feel the wind picking up here. So I wanted to head off in this other direction over here. Let's go for it. There we go. Not that one. Uh, but that one right there. There we go. Totally the one I was aiming for. Let's go for it. Ooh, I can already see the waves starting to pick up. We're going to see what happens when you try to travel by water in a storm. <laughs> this is going to get real intense. Uh, unless the same thing doesn't happen again. Maybe it's not even scripted. Maybe we won't get a storm. Oh, and look at that. It's morning time. And just as it's morning time, we're hitting this island. And it's looking actually awfully small. I hope this is not the island we just came from. Doesn't look like it, but you never know. That would be uh, bad luck, but whatever. It is what it is. We'll get this figured out. Um, at least we can ride out the impending storm that we may or may not have. Wow, that island actually looks really nice. Okay, so we're riding up on it. and looks like there might be something right at the shoreline there. Uh, there's some plants poking up. What is this? What could this be? If it kills me... That would suck. Is this some sort of scrap or something? Uh, we have to go check that out. That's really, uh, that's really odd. Bring our life raft right up to shore here. There we go. Make sure it's not floating away in the water. That was really deep there. I got out and immediately was like underwater. So holy crap. What is that? Is that just some wood? Oh. Well, that's not interesting. Yeah, it's a wood pile. 
I wonder if it gives you more stuff than the tree does. Ah, uh, whatever. It is what it is. Okay, let's get a uh, let's get some sort of weapon equipped here so we can protect ourselves. We'll go with our uh, refined knife, I guess. There we go. And uh, we got to go collect ourselves some leaves. Lots and lots of leaves. Oh, look at this. There is a shipwreck just right offshore. I wonder if that would be easy to get into without having to deal with the sharks. Because look how close it is. It actually looks pretty damn cool, to be honest. It can't be that easy, though. There's got to be a few sharks around. Maybe we can build some platforms over to it. That would save our butt. Or I could take a shark on. Apparently, reef sharks don't bite you, but um, great whites do. So there's two different sharks. I don't know how to tell the difference, but there is. Oh, sick. And this doesn't... Oh, look at this. Oh, crap. It is uh, starting to rain, which means we're going to get that storm. So, oh, there's nothing here. There's just a tarp. Oh, there's some stuff spread out over, all over the water. Okay, so that's a little different. Anyway, uh, we're going to try to get back to our boat here. This island isn't very big, so... Uh, we're going to try to get back to our boat, pull it right in the shore here, and uh, we're going to ride out this uh, this storm. We should be able to collect some uh, palm leaves, too, while we're at it. There's a bunch of little tiny ones all over the beach here. Here we go, life raft. It's just you and me. We're going to ride this out together here. Uh, I don't know how big these waves and stuff can get. So some pe some person said that uh, your um or some people said that your stuff can actually get washed away. And look at that. That's a perfect way you'd want to stash your life raft if you didn't want to get it carried away in the wind. Well, I guess we're going to find out what happens here. I'm going to uh, grab some of these while we're at it. Nice. Nothing like a good old tea storm. By the way, if you hold down R1, this was another tip left by a lot of people, you can actually go into an item called uh, Quick Craft, or a menu called Quick, Quick Craft, uh, and you don't have to hold on to the button. So you can just go uh, up with your arrow, or your R2, <laughs> L2, holy crap. This is why I haven't done tutorials in a while, apparently. Should probably do that, get a little more practice. Anyway, uh, you can actually go through your menu and you can craft whatever you have on you. Uh, someone said to make a tool belt too because it increases your uh, carry capacity. Uh, so let's make a few of these up because that's what those leaves turn into anyway. There we go. So that should be four lashings that we have now. We do. Okay, and uh, if I chop down one of these palm trees, we should have enough to uh, make our loom. Let's try it out. I don't know what you need to make cloth. Hopefully we have some of it. Yeah, those waves are looking uh, pretty intense. I'm glad we actually didn't get caught out in those. That would have sucked. Okay, let's uh, get that loom made here. I'm hearing my uh, wop watch beep at me, and that's not a good thing. Here we go. So we make the loom. Uh, let's place that actually a little higher up here, just in case. I don't want it to get it washed away. There we go. Okay, awesome. Let's see uh, what this thing can do. Okay, so in order to make the cloth here, we have to look into the loom, and uh, then we can craft from there. Oh, we don't have enough room in inventory. Damn it. Okay, let's uh, place this down here. Oh, I don't want to lose, like, these are expensive. There we go. And uh, we'll drop something else we don't really don't need right now. Like a stick. There we go. Okay, we should be able to make ourselves a bandage now. Oh, we still need one damn lashing. Forgot about that. Uh, we need four more of those. Okay, let's go get those quickly. I think we actually might be able to survive this. Let's go. Okay, there we go. So we got all the leaves we need. So let's go ahead and uh, make another lashing. There we are. And we should be able now to make our bandage. We'll go over to consumables. Yes, there we go. We can make a bandage. Oh, and still not enough room in inventory, damn it. There we go. Let's go ahead and uh, use that damn thing. Yeah. Whew. OK, 
Okay, and that should have fixed our bleeding. And it looks like the storm is dissipating and it's daytime. Oh, we made it, guys. We did it. Let's see what our health is here. Oh, we're still looking good on health, too. Nice. That poison really hurt, though. Oh, my God, did it ever hurt. Okay, so we don't have a bleed. We don't have anything else. Uh, we need some water. We need some meat. So we can definitely get the meat and the water we need from this island. There's a whole bunch of crabs and stuff around. We won't be able to stay here for long, uh, but we got to get prepared. So let's go ahead and uh, make another water collector. Water still. So I'm going to drop all this stuff here um, I need for my still in a, in a pile so I can save some room. And uh, we need to make another lashing. But the other thing that we should make right away, because I need to save, is a shelter. So we definitely need still like eight more friggin' leaves. Hopefully I can find some. Uh, I did find some yucca actually right over here that I used. Let's go see if I can't pound some more of those out and make two lashing. Yeah, there's one right there. Another one right there. Sick. Okay, so I think one yucca tree will actually make one lashing. So those are always uh, good finds. There we go. Two lashings made. So I need four palm fronds, which I have right here, and three sticks. Actually, we can make our shelter right here. All I got to do is uh, bust up this uh, palm bunch here. Whoops, wrong button. There we go. Got a whole bunch of fronds right here. And a whole bunch of sticks. We should actually be able to make our shelter by standing right here. So let's go ahead, open up that menu, go over to shelter, and no, it's actually it's not counting these. Okay, is this is this close enough for you? Nope. Okay, I guess I'm gonna have to pick these up. Here we go. One shelter coming up. I'm gonna place it right there and uh, go ahead and save this right away. There we go. Saved ourselves from a bleed. Now, I do think I actually recall someone earlier mentioning uh, that I had a bleed on, and I completely forgot to uh, take a look at it. Okay, so we need a coconut for this here, too, and uh, we have the one palm leaf that we need. Okay, we can make the water still right away. Let's go ahead and break open one of these coconuts. Oh, I do believe that water still. It's actually not just a coconut itself. Let's take a quick look at the uh, the recipe here again. There we go, inspect. This is a coconut flask. And this is where we discovered consum consumables last time. So we actually need to make one of these too. And uh, now we need another lashing. Damn, these things are expensive. Okay, I'm gonna drop this here. There we go. There we go, perfect. And we'll go find enough, hopefully, pond front, or uh, leaves to make another, another lashing. Oh, there's one right there. Cool. This shouldn't be too hard. All right, so I found a bunch of those. It should be easy to make one of these here. There we go. Uh, but I do believe we're really exhausting our resources here, so uh, we won't have much more to go on for lashing from here. But at least everything is safe. I'm not bleeding anymore. Uh, am I even gaining health? Is that a thing? It does look like I'm gaining a little bit of health. We are at one, two, three, almost four bars. I'll have to take a look at it again. And uh, our SPF is high today. It's actually a really sunny, warm day. I'm going to have to keep that in mind. Look at that sun. It's beautiful. Okay, and uh, we can finally make our water still. Let's go ahead and get that done. Here we go. Nice. We'll plant that right here. And uh, go and chop down another tree so we have some palm fronds to feed it. There is something moving around down there. I can't see what it is, but I'll put my cursor on it if I can. My aim of the controller still isn't that great. Uh, but there we go. There's something right there. I don't know what it is. But I'm going to go ahead and save, and uh, we're going to find out. It's a coconut. I was afraid of a coconut. It was moving. I swear it was. Anyway, whoops. May as well grab the whole thing, get some sticks. Uh, we'll make a campfire, too, for the night cycle. And for cooking meat, too. I'm going to get real hungry real soon. But there's a bunch of crabs around, and those are an easy kill. Well, I'm going to bring this over here and drop them so that we have uh, we have the room. 
Uh, what I've been finding, the easiest way to do this is actually equip them here and just uh, do it while you're holding them. It's easier than going in and out of that damn menu. I wish I found that out uh, a couple episodes ago. That would have been nice. Anyway, there's some, uh, I gotta search for some rocks too. I'd like to try to make a campfire uh, with rocks around it. I think that would be neat. It is getting real dark real quick on me here. Uh, that is okay though. I found uh, three rocks, I believe, so far. Yeah, three. Oh wait, yeah, that's three. I think we picked up three. Why does it say only two? That's weird. Maybe because it's uh, what I have in my hand plus the other two. Is that how it works? There we go. I don't even know how many of these we need for a campfire, but I'm grabbing them all. Well, we've made it back home. So that's a thing. Okay, well, let's see if I can't get this campfire done. Ooh, it is dark tonight. Here we go, fire pit. So apparently I need to make a campfire and then put the fire pit around it. So let's see how this works here. Here we go, so we have a campfire. I'm gonna make that nice and even. Put it right there. And uh, let's see if we can't make that fire pit now. There we are. Hey, am I not standing close enough to the rocks? Okay, I'm gonna just uh, pick up the rocks here if I can't find them. There we go, looking at the campfire. Now we can actually craft a uh, fire pit. There we go. Okay, cool. I'm gonna throw uh, my rock on the ground here. And we gotta make ourselves some kindling. Whoa, I threw my axe on the ground. <laughs> my bad. Let's go get the rest of the wood we need from this tree over here. I know it's a little dark here, guys, so I'm gonna actually go ahead and just get this done. We'll get it lit up. Uh, watching dark video can be pretty bad. There we go, we got some kindling going on. Let's go ahead and uh, light this up. There we go, we got a campfire going now. Uh, so I wonder what the advantage of the fire pit itself is. I don't even know. Let's throw this on the ground. I like throwing stuff on the ground, it's fun. I made two of these. Oh, let's get our uh, water still here. Nice and loaded up. Oh, it actually has some water in it. Oh, it's because we actually put one in it at the time. That's funny. Whoops. Durr. There we go. Feed the water still. Nice. Uh, I should go and actually kill a few crabs here. I'm going to go do that. Well, I went around the entire island here and I was uh, able to get together uh, three meat. Three crab meat. So that, that works, I guess. Uh, let's get that put in our hand here. There we go. We can use that and attach it to the fire. Apparently, uh, if you throw these on the ground, here you go. Let's just do one of these. Uh, press your L2 button. You can drag it and put it on the fire. And it cooks like that, too. I wonder what the purpose of uh, doing that, then, is. Let's, uh, let's go ahead and uh, wait these both out, because I don't want to waste another small meat if that's not the case. So we can also eat these uh, these coconuts, too. Uh, let's give that a go. I'm going to cut this thing in half here. There we go. We're going to use our axe. And uh, eat both pieces. They don't give a lot, but food is food. There we go. That helped a bit. And our water is getting low, but this uh, water still, it'll take care of us. Looks like we're going to need some more, uh, some more fronds sooner than later. Okay, so I heard a couple dings. I think that means... My meat is done. Oh, it does. Look at that. So it it does work. That's that's pretty damn cool. Uh, let's drop a couple of things here. Uh, actually, we can use these fronds. Let's go ahead and put these right in the still. And uh, we'll grab my meat here. Mmm. Delicious. Nice. So what did that bring us up here for food? Well, a decent amount. Not enough, but a decent amount. I do think I grabbed my nuts here, too. Here we go. Coconuts. Okay, let's get this uh, all fixed up. There we go. A couple more coconut pieces. Got a drink out of it as well. And uh, I think we're actually doing pretty good on food. I think we're looking pretty good. Oh, and that other sound is uh, the water still. Oh, that's cool. How are we on water? Nice. Now I just got to figure out health. Oh, I think your health goes up as you eat? Is that how that works? Because it's going up now. Finally, up to like past four. What did I do that caused my health to go up? Hmm. Well, uh, 
we're looking pretty good here. Let's chill out by the fire. I'm really loving this game. I like the tropical theme. It's a, it's a nice little break from the norm. Uh, but let's go ahead and I've unlocked some more crafting stuff. I'm going to take a look through my menu, see if I can see anything cool. We do have something now called a crude bow. So we can make bows and arrows now. Uh, how would you make flint? That is the next question. Uh, we have leather. We can make leather. Planks. Refined spear. Okay. Okay, let's figure out how you make the... Uh, I'm assuming that's a flint right there. A stone... Oh, there's stone tools. Oh, that's easy. You just need, uh, you just need enough stones. Awesome. The other thing I want to ask, too, is if you break these down before you leave, do you get some of the supplies back? Is that a thing? Like, can you can you break one down one of your stations and be a okay? Um, anyway, let's wait till morning here, and uh, we'll take a look at some more things. Okay, so I'm assuming this is the uh, logical upgrade from the, uh, the campfire here, meat smoker. Uh, so you got the campfire ring... So I'm assuming that's the campfire itself. Uh, three sticks, a lashing, and a tarp. Ooh, that's not too bad. Okay. Well, I'm really impatient here. Hurry up, morning. You know what? I'm going to go to sleep. Let's go to sleep. Oh, look at that. Perfect. It is morning time. The moon is going down. Uh, does that have... Oh, sleeping heals you. Wow, okay. Pro tip right there. <laughs> Sleeping heals you. Who would have thought? Anyway, it's a good morning to go out and uh, take a look around the island. See what we can salvage from here. Seen some more of those palm trees. Those young ones. I like them. So I think there definitely has to be a shark over here. We got something floating in the water right there. Uh, how deep is it? Ooh, that actually looks like it gets real deep real fast right here i wish i could really see into it although that doesn't look like it's anything that's um easily easy to loot so i'm thinking this is the same situation here too there's a big drop off right here and uh probably a shark floating around it or two or maybe not maybe not that could be deceiving though look at these fish here how deep are they swimming yeah they're not swimming very deep at all Hmm. Okay, you know what? I'm going to risk it for the biscuit. Here we go. What do we have? Drop off? A little bit, but it's not so bad. Uh, how do we get up on these things? We're going to get grabbed by a shark. I know it. There we go. Oh, you just got to hold X on it and you can climb up. Okay, cool. Let's look on the first floor here. What do we have? We have some barrels. Uh, do these break down if I hit them or something? Oh, look at that. Okay, cool. So what can we do with this? I do not know what to do with these barrels here. You can interact with them, but apparently I'm doing it wrong. Maybe you have to do crafting right beside the barrel. Uh, let's take a look here if I can hit the right damn button. Because uh, I think the hobo stove needs one. It does. So how do we get a barrel home? <gasps> Durr. We hold on to it. Bring it home. Oh, nice. We can, we, can, we can check out the hobo stove. I think that would be pretty cool. Okay, well, I'm glad I figured out that little uh, very confusing thing. Console. Press L1 to open. Well, let's check this out. What do we have in here? Electric, electrical vehicle part. Uh, parts from a flying machine. What? Oh, that's cool. It's parts from a flying machine or something or other. Okay, let's check out what's in this wood crate here. We got ourselves a flare gun. We got a tarp. And we got some rations. Cool. And apparently you could pick up this whole container. There we go. With the stuff in it. So they're actually quite useful. Nice. This was a nice little cool loot. Let's see if we can't uh, get one of these barrels back home with us here. Oh, oh, there we go. And we got to grab it and swim backwards with it. Hopefully not gra grab by a shark or anything crazy. Cool, we did it. Look at that. We can make ourselves a hobo stove. It's going to be cool. I don't know what it's going to be used for, but we can make one. 
bring you home. <laughs> okay, so our barrel is home. Let's take a look at that recipe here again. Uh, we got the hobo stove, so I wonder if I can place it. Oh yeah, because I guess the campfire would be burned out, right? You know what? Let's see if we can't uh, stand right here. I wonder if this is close enough here. Okay, so I guess we need an empty set of rings. Let's stand right on top of the uh, em empty campfire here and see if it counts it. Oops, here we go. Okay, so it does count it. So I guess we just got to grab this and bring it a little closer here. There we go. Okay, can we craft this now? Here we go. Hobo stove. Cool. Okay, so I'll move it back a little bit and uh, place that. Oh, cool. Look at this thing. I love it. A little hobo stove. Okay, neat. So uh, I guess we fill this with sticks and then light it. That's how it works. Oh, and then you can put your meat on top of it, on top of the uh, the grill. Oh, that's actually kind of cool. I like that. Not incredibly useful, but still very useful. <laughs> Great argument on that one. Okay, there's one other area here. I've seen some tarps and stuff floating around. Should go take a look at that. Oh yeah, like look at that. It's, is that something in the water over there? Let's go check it out. Oh, that's just some coral stuff. Damn, that looked interesting. Oh, there's a whole ton of rocks over here. Look at all these rocks. Oh, and some crab. We need you. We need your nutrients. Oh, and another crab. I guess a lot of these are actually in the water. I never... Whoa. What in the world? Holy crap, that thing went all Chuck Norris on me. <laughs> that was intense. Okay, you little bastard. Let's try this again. There you go. How about that? I bet that hurt, didn't it? Stupid thing. Yeah, there's stones all over the place. Let's grab all of these up because there's some uh, cool stuff we can make with these. Okay, here we go. So literally right beside the ship, there is um, another shipwreck stuff that I've seen over here. So it looks like that one is just uh, common with supplies. Wow, I can almost literally almost stab that bird. That would have been cool. It would have been a nice snipe. Uh, whoa, what is that over there? Looks like another barrel. Maybe that's indicating that there's some stuff close by that you can loot. Yeah, because we got ourselves a tarp right here. Not enough room in inventory, damn it. Uh, but that's it. Just a tarp. Okay, I'm going to leave that there and we're going to head back home. Oh, this is cool. Check it out. We can see clear across and you can actually see that little canister on the island or the uh, container. You can actually see it from here. So that's the island we just, just came from. Wow, we can actually start organizing by making landmarks. I wonder if your structures show up from that distance, too. Um, that would be really cool. Okay, I gotta take all my stuff here and throw it in a giant pile and get organized. Uh, but I'm just looking at the time here, guys, and I'm getting carried away once again. Um, I'm having a ton of fun with this game. Uh, but I've ran out of time to do recordings, so I do hope you enjoyed, and I'd love to see you in another episode. Peace out, guys, and always back up them game saves. Stay classy.